Welcome to Camnet Island. This island was once uninhabited and filled with forests, hills, cliffs, rivers and mountains. A few decades ago it became the site for a summer camp, however it did go bankrupt later on. They left the island and its campsite to rot. That is until I bought this piece of land to start a reality show here with U22 contestants. Any questions? Is there any wild creatures around here? Pfft, we have a ton of grizzly bears around here. You said bears? <laughs> Yummy berries! Like, seriously, why would a guy like him take our friends away like that? How am I going to meet up with my other friends now? We still have the both of us. As long as we're still together, we can survive through this. We better stay together throughout the entire show if we want to win a mansion. Wow, you two are really irritating. Yikes. No offense, but I hope you both get out really early. Here we all be sleeping in these bunk houses. The left one is for the boys and the right one is for the girls. I'm non-binary. Where can I sleep? Oh, choose whatever one you're comfortable with. I'll go with the girls. They're kind of crummy. Then you can sleep outside with the mosquitoes. Never mind, I'll sleep inside. Hey, look! It's Feather Duster! There's a spider on the ceiling! It's just a harmless spider. It can't be that bad. Yeah, it's just a bug. Still, it might hurt me! Oh, you better watch out, or else Mr. Edgy Wincy Spider will haunt your dreams. Please don't scare him no more. You know how easily scared he could be. Hey! You can come off the bunk houses now. Does anyone know where the TV is? Oh! There it is. I hate my life so much. <laughs> what a really funny show! Also on the campsite, we have the cafeteria, where you guys will be eating the finest meals for three times a day while also chatting with each other. Give me food. Not right now. We still have a few other places to show. Okay, let's move on. And here we have this old shed I found, where you can go and invent about your thoughts or anything else that you want to get off your shoulders. Anyone want to try? Uh, I can do skateboarding. What's the purpose of this room again? Hi, I'm Fuzzy Dice. Do you think anyone is going to tell the difference between us? Well, I'm the smarter one. I'm cuter. No, I'm way cuter, says the ugly one. I've been more fuzzier than you are. You're the one who messes up everything. At least I'm self-aware. Hey! It's pretty obvious much of us stronger dudes have higher chances of making it far in the game, while the lame and weak dorks are the first to be booted. That is, unless this show uses the viewer voting system. The last piece is the amphitheater, where you guys will be attending the elimination ceremonies. In each elimination, the losing team will have to go up to this voting poll and fill in the bubble of which contestant they want to be kicked out of the show. The one that gets the most votes is eliminated, will be met with a pair of balloons that will be tied to them and they'll float away from the show and can never return, ever. The members of the team still in the game are rewarded with mini prizes, like sweets and props that may come in handy for the next challenge. 
do the only contestants float away to? If my hypothesis is correct, I'd say there's a more greater probability that some would end up in the middle of the ocean. Oh dear! Ending up in the middle of the ocean? I don't want to end up being shark bait! Or you might end up on the moon, which would be wicked cool! I don't think balloons can reach above the atmosphere. They will pop before you can even go into space. Enough arguing! We need to start the first challenge. But you barely mentioned anything about some darn challenge! What even is the first challenge? Follow me. Another walking around? <laughs> My leg is getting really tired from this. Is this the challenge? Oh, you bet. You guys are rock climbing on these climbing walls. Everyone has to climb to the top, and the last one to do so will get their team put up for elimination. Um, we don't have teams yet. I have a bucket of 22 cards. Half are blue, and the other half are red. If you get blue, go on the left climbing wall. If you get red, go on the right climbing wall. I didn't get a card! Sorry, I don't think there's any more left. Ah, oh, seriously? Uh, does anyone have an extra card? We're supposed to have one. Well, sorry. I didn't know we shared a brain. We're connected to the string, so it makes us one contestant. And that doesn't mean we can have two cards. Now, give this piece of candy your card. Fine. I've never been happier than ever to receive this card. Thank you so much. Wait, I'm not on the same team as Gyros. I already miss Washer. Relax, it's nothing to be worried about. It's best we focus on the challenge, okay? With teams, they'll need names. I already have names for your teams, so you won't have to make them. The left side will be the lightning bolts, and the right side will be the erupting volcanoes. Now that we have our team names, we shall officially start our first challenge. Now, go! I can't climb up there, I'm scared of heights! I have something that can help you get up there! <laughs> well, that worked! How am I gonna do this challenge if I don't have any arms? Well, I can wrap you around me! Just be gentle to me. I wish me and Washer could climb together. Relax, you can climb with me. I ain't gonna hurt a fly. Okay, but it would still be better with Washer. Just pretend that I'm Washer that's right beside you. You can do it. Coaster, are you gonna climb up? You're just standing there doing nothing. You know, this rock climbing is too easy for me. I can do it in a minute. You don't seem like the type of person to. Let me just climb alongside with you. I can't believe how good we are at this climbing stuff. Yeah, I think we're so close to the top, I can feel it! I think you're stepping too hard on my head. You're the one who keeps moving a lot, quit it! I thought we were doing so well on this, and yet you keep being the boss of me! We're almost there, just shut up! 